Job Boat Sales are delighted to present Annabelle, a Clipper 30 Flybridge Cruiser. Now the Clipper 30 is the, uh, shall we say, baby sister of the enormously popular Clipper 34, built in uh, Taiwan um, in the uh, late 80s. And this boat really uh, is a great example of the Taiwanese workmanship in terms of the fit out and uh, the way they manage the timber side of the, uh, the boat. Um, it really impresses as soon as you walk into the saloon. I, I feel it's got a little bit of a wow factor about it. It's presented in excellent condition, particularly given the age of the boat. So as we go through, uh, you've just noticed the galley um, off to the port side. Um, there's a really nice settee on the starboard side, uh, and then a great dinette um, off to port two, which also converts to a double berth. The settee two provides a very uh, very good sized single berth. Uh, good, um, good helm station, excellent vision, and just sitting in the saloon area, there's a really nice feel about the boat. I've been very, very impressed with it. The, uh, now the uh, forward cabin has uh, uh, two singles, has a V-berth and an insert could be uh, made to provide another double. Um, full bathroom, which we'll see in a second. Um, again, good quality fit out, uh, lots of nice teak, teak timber trim uh, and uh, all the white as you'd expect in a bathroom. That's a great shot of the saloon as we head back aft. Um, really nice, spacious, open feel. To it, and that's really uh, a lot to do with the windows. Nice parquetry floor too. The uh, boat's powered by a 80 horsepower Ford Lehman um, diesel motor. Amazingly economical running. Uh, it uses about four to five litres an hour at six and a half knots. The boat will cruise up to seven knots. Uh, and it was uh, fully rebuilt a very low 400 hours ago. Nice cockpit, good access up to the flybridge. And this is where you really get your outside uh, living area. Nice big flybridge, functional uh, helm station there, and uh, great seating uh, behind, uh, as we'll see as we pan around. So, uh, yeah, a few deck chairs, casual table, and you've got a great outside living area. So, again, as I say, for a 30-footer, this boat packs a heap of punch. The uh, decks are easy to get around, um, so uh, they're not terribly narrow or anything. There's a uh, good area for it. You could sunbathe up there if you weren't on the flybridge. Um, really, this is a very nice package. Uh, plenty of room, two doubles, one single, so five berths, uh, and very well fitted. It's a lovely boat, really.